All right, guys. So we have Ricky's 2023 Camaro Winnelly. He's been driving it. He has a Borla Attack cat back, and that's the only mod he has. But Rick, the Roto Fab. and a Roto Fab. Can you tell us what you just did? I bought a lot of car parts. He bought a lot of car parts. All the homies and us, we get into crippling debt over car parts. He went ahead and got an MSD intake manifold, flex fuel sensor, um, 102 Nick Williams throttle body, and and two inch long tube headers. So right now this car is a six speed manual and this one's a 10 speed. And on a 60 roll, they're pretty dead even. Now, it was a fantastic driver mod on this car. It was me versus this car. And he can't take the fact that, you know, the cars were right next to each other, but. I'm not lying. I beat you. you didn't beat me. Where are you ahead of me? I was in the 60 roll. We didn't do it from a 60. Okay, from 50, whatever. Uh, 55. How many times you Once. Three times. Three times. Three okay. Times it's a manual car. You got to line them up perfectly. He wanted to do like a 40 roll on the car. This is that's first gear in this car. How to make, make make it make it make sense? But e either way, we're gonna cut that out because this guy's lying. Unless he wants to rerun it right now in the rain. In the rain right now. Oh. <laughs> You got the Texas Speed Cab. Yeah, is it the track attack? It's, it's L LC7. Okay, what is that? It's a See, max effort. Then it's not for me. Charlie, back up. Hold on. Charlie. It's if, from Texas Speed. If it's not max effort NA, I don't want to hear about it. This is what it is. Now let me see the whipple. All right, so we're starting today's vlog with. Hello, brother. Hello, bro brother. If you guys don't remember, this guy is slow speeds, slow speeds. He used to have a green S197 turbo, but you know, he, he had to do it to him. He had to do it to him. He got a brand new S550. And uh, we're headed over to our buddy Alan and Rick's apartment because they actually uh, are about to go drop off the Camaro. If you guys saw it in the previous video, uh, Ricky went ahead and got all these modifications for his 2023 Camaro 1LE. Uh, which is basically going to go everything but heads and a so super excited for him and we're about to go drop off that car all right so we got ricky's car here at the shop he brought it to rated r performance here in san antonio uh they have some pretty neat vehicles inside and they're basically gonna do this job within the week uh ricky has his uh all his parts in the trunk right now we got the headers we already put them inside and uh just kind of like old just like the old video just in case just in case you guys didn't see what's in this what's in this one right here Probably like the Johnson lifters or something. Uh, I guess LS7 lifters from the Corvette kit that Texas Speed provides. Uh huh. So I got the LC7 headers. The LC7 cam. Cam. Yeah. Cam. He got the Cooks two inch long tube headers. He got the LC7 cam kit from Texas Speed. He went uh, and drove up to Dallas to go get it. They said that they recommended this kit for him. He doesn't need a stall because he is a six speed manual car. So it should work pretty well. Uh, he went ahead and got the tuning device. Are you gonna go with GPI after all? Uh, he doesn't know yet, but he already got he already got the tuning device. He's dabbling right now. He still has a couple more days to decide just because of the installation itself. And um, currently on the car, he already has the Borla attack cat back system and he has a Rotofab cold air intake, but he is looking to make a little bit more horsepower. We're saying it's gonna probably be between 500 to 600 horsepower. We don't know where it's gonna land exactly. And uh, are you gonna go 85 after all? Yeah. Okay, 85. They're saying it's gonna be around 520 that they think because uh, I'm not getting a new head. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, install it, so with the heads, probably be around 560. Okay. So that's what they've seen. What about the heads? Did they recommend any in particular or anything uh, like that? Texas Speed. Uh, they have good heads. Texas uh, Speed? Yeah. Or like LME. There's LME. also um, CID heads, but those are like the most expensive, right? They're all around. Right. Yeah, okay. Uh, so they're all around the same price, but regardless uh ricky's gonna go ahead and get a bump in horsepower so he should be able to drive this car with and basically have a lot more fun with it um how long is it gonna take two days two days that's not bad at all hopefully no. before brian leaves yeah hopefully before brian leaves so he can go ahead and get to drive the car or at least ride in it <laughs> all right so we got ricky's car picking it up from rated r how excited are you pretty excited pretty excited all right can you go ahead and turn on the car for us this is a first review or first first little cold start of the LC7 Texas Speed Cam with all the other mods mentioned before. Sound of that? Dude, it sounds good. It does sound pretty good. All right, let's go for some driving. 
All right, so we're officially in here, you know, we're gonna do a review from, you know, how, how it's compared stock to, you know, full bolt on with the cam. Psych! But look at that. Why, why is it, why is it sh shaking like that, Rick? I don't know why it's shaking like that. They might have still done something crazy to the car. I know. What the hell is that? Uh, we ahead. just came in for an oil change and then the car is freaking... Oh, brap, 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 brap. How does it feel? Hold on. Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> Are you excited? Hold on, hold on. <laughs> what was that? Why'd you shift to third? Hold on, hold on. I need a first, three second, three third, through four. And this is with the headers? Yeah, this is with the headers. It's, it's not, not crazy it's loud. It's not that loud. It's honestly. not that loud. It's not that bad. Oh, no. did, did you want to take your stock parts? So we can put them in my truck. You can put it in the back there in the back where you have where you have your other stock cap back. Hey, this isn't loud at all. I'm sure with the tune, it's going to, from GPI. Oh, yeah. So, better. oh, yeah, I forgot to mention, guys. So, Rick did end up going with the GPI tune, but dude's going on a vacation. So, what we had to do was we had to go ahead and uh, ask, rated our performance, if they could go ahead and do us the favor of giving us kind of like a startup tune kind of like cruise tune so he can't go wide open throttle just yet i wish i could bring you guys that video but i can't um probably a week yeah in about a week once we do some data log revisions on the car itself but rick is this is his daily driver so he has a chop and monster and a daily and uh he, he needed a tune so he can go ahead and uh you know get to work and back and stuff like that so guys enjoyed that cold start and you guys just like cars overall i know this is kind of like a video over the camaro but that's ricky's car this is my twin turbo s197 
Makes around 1200 horsepower and actually runs low nines with the T56 manual trans in it. So if you guys are interested in that, feel free to go ahead and subscribe to the channel. You'll be seeing Ricky's Camaro, my twin turbo car, and I'll also have a single cab with a Whipple supercharger. So go ahead and stick around for those. And uh, back to Ricky's Camaro. Now that the camera's on, I wanted to come on here and ask a huge favor of you guys. As you guys saw earlier in the video, Ricky was wearing a military uniform and he's gonna get deployed. So if you guys wanna go ahead and thank him for, for his service, right? <laughs> we, we made a deal that he's gonna be gone for a whole year. His baby is, has nowhere to stay and uh, I'm willing to accept his baby and he's willing to leave me his Camaro 1 LA that just recently got a cam installed. If we, or if you guys can get me to 5,000 subscribers before the time he leaves. So he leaves on about June, July, somewhere June. around. Yeah, June. So Help we have him get to 5,000. 5,000. And this could possibly be all those shifts yep. for about a year. For about a year. For about now, a year. We are going to have, you know, it's going to be in the garage. It's going to be garage kept. Hopefully we have a house by, by that time or a little bit later. And also we're going to put a mileage limit on how much I'm going to be able to drive the car. Now, I said 3,000 because I really don't feel to see myself driving it unless it's kind of like cars and coffee and stuff like that. But even if that's the case, I'm taking my car and I'm not lending the car to anybody else. So the car's pretty much going to stay. It might be like a little weekend cruiser. And uh, just to give you guys some uh, more videos and more content on a GM platform, because as you guys know, we're, we're Chevy, or I mean, we're Ford boys out here. <laughs> All you Chevy boys in the, in the comments and in watching the videos, sub like the video yeah. you know get him to five thousand yeah five thousand so and, and y'all can see this happy maybe, maybe one day get boosted yeah maybe <laughs> buy, has, uh, buy Ricky, all the shit yeah and rick and ricky ha uh, ricky has a lot of big plans coming up for this car we're gonna try to guide him but at the end of the day it's his car he's gonna make the decisions uh he is gpi tuned uh right now at the rated r performance here in san antonio they did give us a base file tune just because gpi is actually gonna be uh out of town and they're not gonna be able to get us that tune in time so um yeah yeah, I appreciate or huge shout out to them because if not, the car would stay at the shop till next week, and uh, we'll we'll bring some videos once we start dataloging this car, and uh, once we start having some fun. So. Oh, we're gonna be ripping it. Yes, Mexico. Sir. Awesome. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Uh, they're gonna be like. Bald eagle, fuck it. <laughs> Sounds good. Sounds good, not gonna lie. Not gonna lie. It rings. I know. Alright, good. <laughs> Subscribe to all those ships. God damn, Rick. Once again, if you guys don't know the mods or you guys want to run down again, it's a uh, Rotofab, cold air intake, Caltech, all oh, go. All right, I'll, I'll shortly interrupt it, but uh, yeah, so it's a uh, Rotofab cold air intake, the Caltech throttle body, uh, MSD, um, intake manifold, Cooks two inch long tube headers, a Borla attack full cat back system and um, and the cam and the Texas speed cam the LC7 so um, it's a stage 3 cam it came with all the full kit basically and they said since he's a manual car he doesn't need a stall and it's the one of the most aggressive uh, daily driver cams that they recommend
cars home. How to drive. No. We didn't do too bad detailing this thing. All right, let's go call that Alan, Brian, and let's get their reactions. So Brian completely saw a 2023 eruption green, and Alan's is a 2020 with a cold air intake and a Lund tune. Race is coming soon because I think there's a new NA King in the group. Oh, you know, pretty excited for this guy's car All right, right here. That's it. All right. Uh, pretty excited or I'm, no? I mean, I'm pretty excited about it. I've never actually... I mean, I've heard them, but like not to like where I can hear it all the time. Yeah, so, yeah, yeah. I think yeah. they're pretty excited. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know if, if the puppies are excited or not. But <laughs> let's go ahead and check it out. All right, Ricky's getting inside the car. Let's get the reaction. You know, that they, they used to be NA Kings. Let's get the reaction. Can y'all get a little bit closer? What do you think? It's sick. Sounds pretty damn good. So Rated R gave us like a baseball tune just for him to get home and like drive the car, but not for what? They said it'll idle good, it'll idle fine. The idle of the, of the cam might change just a tad bit, but like uh, nothing too crazy. It might be a little bit louder. Oh, he says once oh, we get the GPI. Yeah, yeah. Oh. once he gets the tune from GPI and everything like that. So now it's just time to data log the car and, uh, you know, hope, hope fucking GPI enjoys his vacation. <laughs> For real though. Bro. You know, this is actually the first Lund tune Camaro. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just fucking Lund tune. tune first. John, John, if you're watching this, you want to tune this car, Alejandro, you want to tune this car, let us know. Um, I, like, I went to 3,500, that's as close as I went. Oh, okay. So, nothing too crazy. Dude, it burbles fucking god. Bro, you thought, Way more you than before? The burble was when it burbles are loud. Bro, no. bro the window's like, down. It's like AK 47, it's like. <laughs> Okay, I don't know about that. That's how it is. <laughs> you like this guy or not? So they said that it's not super loud because the way of the like the X pipe set up on the Perla cap back. I wouldn't want oh. it to be louder. He says if he runs like a true X pipe, it'll be louder. I wouldn't want it louder. Yeah, Honestly, no, this it sounds has good. a really good tone right now. Yeah, I don't I want to take away. It's not like crazy obnoxious. And I would just wait for the GPI tune to like come in, like for the final, like actual. Oh, for sure. basically end the video i appreciate you guys watching hope you guys enjoyed if you stayed till the end uh let me know what you guys think about the camaro what videos you guys want to see with that uh also want to show my f-150 single cab i know you guys saw the car in the earlier clips and um yeah stick around subscribe if you guys can get me to 5,000, i basically get ricky's camaro for a year uh while he's on deployment so i'd really appreciate the support and uh yeah hope you guys have a great day weekend night and i'll catch you guys later